the TV book club with Specsavers. The news where you are is set in Birmingham and it's a book about a character called Frank Allcroft. Frank is a local TV news presenter. His on-screen persona is quite corny. He peppers his news bulletins with um, really awful jokes and bad puns. But off screen, he's actually quite a grounded and thoughtful man. And what tends to preoccupy Frank really are the things that don't make it onto the news. He has a sort of odd fixation with people who die alone and it bothers him that anyone should vanish without trace. Birmingham is, um, is really a character in the book because I think a lot of the themes in the book, even if they're dealing with people, sort of talk about the city as well. You know, Birmingham I think is a strange mixture of ambition and insecurity and I think that's reflected in the characters. It's, um, it has a lot to be, to be proud of but it's also often worries about the way it looks in front of the rest of the world. There's something about the way the city treats its old buildings that I found kind of analogous with the way maybe people look at uh, ageing and particularly that degree of should we let people age gracefully or should we give them a facelift or should we demolish them? You know, what's, uh, what do we do with things when they are aged and no longer fashionable? Well, this, I think this is a great book. Um, it starts off in chapter one without giving anything away that Phil is killed by a hit-and-run drive and you think it's going to be a crime novel, mm -hmm. murder mystery. And it, and it sort of is, but it's much more than that, isn't it? Oh, it's, oh yes, it is. I mean, it, I think it's an absolutely fantastic oh, I book. It, I yeah. really loved it because it addresses issues which I think a lot of the time people don't want to face, like the issue of ageing. Mm -hmm. all quite unpalatable topics and quite a yeah. light mm -hmm. and you know, but it's quite comical way it's at times, those things really. What I like is, is a novel that's about people living now, doing kind of things that we all know and think about. Like going to the shops yeah. and yeah. work. And, and, and that makes it sound mundane, but it, it's, it's within the kind of struggle of being a beleaguered human being that we all kind of find interest, mm. isn't it? Well, I that's, think. The, that's the genius of the author, because it is mundane, yeah. it is everyday life, but she makes it sparkle and, that's and she makes it witty. has got a lot to do with the characters and, as yeah, well, because yeah, the characters are so strong and you kind of, yeah. yeah, she's not hesitant with them, you kind of fall in love with them within a page or two, don't I you? Enjoy enjoy it. It. I, I was swept along uh, mm. completely by it, and I think that, that the, ang the idea which touches on something that really fascinates me of that, of the, of the city changing yeah. and the people remaining the same and looking for their legacy within the city is, mm. is absolutely right up my street as a subject. Mm. Mm. And, and, and I've never seen anybody deal with that. The TV Book Club with Specsavers.